Well, Darren, that feels a, a whole lot better, doesn't it? Three points on the board. Yeah, it's a massive three points, you know. we not won this season and just before the international break. Um, we really need three points today and um, we've managed to do that. Um, it doesn't matter how you do it. Coming here is a real tough game away from home to Stoke and, and we're really happy to win the match. Sending toffs obviously made a, a big difference. Did you get much of a view of either of those? Uh, the first one I've seen the hand in the face. The second one I didn't see much of it. I um, can only say that I think it's a very good referee and it's easy to shy away from the second decision after he made the first decision but you've got to treat each incident individually and he did that and, and um, he just he felt there were red cards and although a lot of people think it's easy playing against them nine men you know it's it can sometimes be more difficult especially when you've got that one goal you don't know where to stick or twist so it's a real interesting situation to be in and we're just thankful that we've seen it out. Goal came at an important time just before the break before they could get in and, and get organised again. Yeah exactly it was a fantastic cross from Ricky and a great header from Solomon and you know everyone's pleased for him to get off the mark and it'll be great for his confidence. It will make a big difference for him coming back, he'll feel the, the weight off his shoulders on it. He will, yeah, all strikers, you know, when you've you know been bought for a lot of money, you know, you're judged on goals and you know, that'll be a big relief for him. And for everyone, he's got that goal as quickly as possible and hopefully he doesn't look back now. You say in the second half two banks of four, it was difficult to, to find a way through. Yeah, it was. It's, as I said to you before, it's one of those things where it's dangerous to go gung ho, and then you leave yourself open for a counter attack. And you know, a lot of people didn't know where to stick or twist, and you you do a lot of things that come unnaturally to you. You find yourself a lot of time on the ball, but there's not necessarily any passes forward, and you don't. The pitch was dry, and you know all these things. But you know, we kept saying, keep the ball going side to side. The most important thing is don't concede. We've already had a goal. If we get a second one, great. Look to get the second one, but let's not go crazy and try and get it and get caught at the back. Three clean sheets from, from four games, that's a, a good statistic as well. Yeah, it is. Away from home, not concede a goal and, you know, picked up um, a win today, you know, off the back of two really tough, you know, arguably two of the best teams in the league at home. Um, so, you know, taking all things into account, I think it's been a very solid start to the season, but, you know, we, we feel we've got a lot more in us and hopefully once the transfer window ends and we get the squad that's settled down, we can really work on going forward for the rest of the season.